deep in the forest, there is a big chestnut tree. Every year, the tree will produce an abundance of chestnuts, providing for many animals in the forest. One day, a family of monkeys come to collect the chestnuts. Seeing so many chestnuts on the ground, they are very happy. They collect many nuts, not only for themselves, but also for other monkeys as well. As they are collecting the chestnuts on the ground, more fall down from the tree. So the mother and the baby monkeys excitedly gather more nuts. But the father monkey stops them. He reminds them to take only what they need and leave the rest for the fox. So they stop picking and happily carry their share of the chestnuts home. Soon enough, the fox comes along. Seeing chestnuts all over the place, the fox is also very happy. He takes his time to pick and gather the chestnuts into a pile. But before taking them home, the fox thinks of the dormice. So he takes some nuts out from his pile, leaving them on the ground. Satisfied, he wraps up his chestnuts and leaves. Not long after, a group of dormice show up. They run around under the tree. And busily gather the chestnuts into several piles. When they are done, they look around to see if more animals are coming. With no other animals in sight, the dormice collect all of the chestnuts on the ground and go home cheerfully. After the dormice leave, a ferret badger arrives. Looking around the place, he doesn't see any chestnuts. Looking up at the tree, he sees clusters of chestnuts staring back at him. Standing alone under the tree, he starts to blame himself for being late. He looks up at the tree again and knows that he should only collect chestnuts that are ripe and fall from the tree on their own, instead of climbing up the tree to pluck them. Despite feeling disappointed, the ferret badger waits patiently for nature to take its course. A crow sees all this. Feeling very sorry for the ferret badger, she decides to help him. So she flies up to the chestnut tree, perches on a branch and starts to bounce up and down until some ripe chestnuts begin to drop to the ground. The 
the ferret badger is surprised and overjoyed. He goes around to collect all of the chestnuts on the ground and goes home with great contentment. Seeing the ferret badger leap away with an armful of chestnuts, the crow is very happy for him. Only when we live in harmony with one another can our society be peaceful and the world be safe for all.